it's a beautiful day here in Vancouver again today. I'm going back to IKEA to return one of the lights because it uses IKEA light bulbs and I don't want that. I wanted to try it out with the light bulb I got from Home Depot where you can change the color of the light bulb. So here you go again. for lights. Don't power them up. Let's get this light built. Looking back at this now, I was so dumb to continue building even when the light couldn't connect. I tried to figure out later why. The light bulb only works with a 2.4 GHz connection, and even when I got my router to be on that connection instead of the 5 GHz, it wasn't working. So I ended up doing a whole lot of work for nothing. another light. Hopefully this time I got it right. So this time I got it from Amazon and here it is. Um, the box feels pretty light. Uh, hopefully this is gonna work. Um, it did say photography lighting on the Amazon website. Uh, so hopefully this is it. No more lights after this. I 
it's got the standard um, quarter inch screw. Ow, ow, ow. So, if I look at it, it is quite bright. So, it can go dimmer, dimmer, dimmer. So, let's see if this is the dimmest. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Seven, let's see. It does come with some color filters. some filming and see if this is uh, bright enough. So I think there is some adjustment here. Go whichever way I need it to be. brightest setting on the ring light and then this is the brightest setting on this light. So we'll see how it goes. There are other, it does come with other adapters. Uh, again with the standard quarter inch screw. So after unboxing the Amazon lights, I've been using them and so far they have been useful. And looks like I won't be buying any more lights until these break down. Thank you for watching and I promise the organization video and a nail polish tour is coming.